So today I'm teetoning the cloth cyanotypes that um, I made the other day. Um, and I'll show you that process. There's a couple in here right now that are um, toning. This is a, <clears throat> a bath with um, TSB, a tablespoon of TSB to a quart of water. And for the tea, I use um, six uh, Irish breakfast tea bags and a quart of water. Um, sometimes you can do this right away. You can do this like immediately after you've made your print, but um, you can also wait. So I usually um, rinse the print, keep the water on a trickle, because I after I put it in the bleach, and you can watch the color change. It goes from a bright blue to more of an indigo and then you start to see, especially the light areas, really start to fade. And I, I typically like to pull it out before it fades too much and rinse it. This is just to get some of the cyanotype out, some of the, some of the blue out. Um, in theory, I guess you can take like all the blue out and there will still be the chemical in the cloth that will absorb the tannins from the tea and color it, but I don't know, I've just, I've just found the process of bleaching a little, then toning, and then going back into the bleach later um, is the way to go. And so we'll leave that one in. These have been in here for a little while, so this one I think is ready to take out. <clears throat> and I'll rinse the tea out of it. It's kind of, this has got a lot of light in it, so I'm not sure how this one's going to do, and actually this is one that I'm going to leave blue, but you can watch the color change um, as it's in the bleach, and the blue goes out and the, um, the browns start to come. It's actually really fun to watch it as it changes in the bleach. I don't think TSB is too hard on your hands. I try not to <laughs> put my hands in it too much. Um, you could wear gloves or use tongs, I suppose, um, but it's not as it's not as toxic as some uh, some of the chemistry. So, so that's just about done. Sometimes there's a little bit of blue left in it, but I actually like it um, to have the brown with just bits of blue showing up. Kind of a cool effect. You could water bath this, I suppose, but I generally with these cloth ones, it, it seems to wash out pretty quickly. And we'll hang this one up. The other one that I did, I actually like that one a lot. And then this is what I just did. You can see there's actually, well, it's hard to tell because you have the reflection of the water still in there. But um, you can see the bits of blue here and there, which actually makes it kind of interesting. And this is this was a test um, of the, this print. It wasn't anything I was going to save or. But I just wanted to try and get the toning and see how that would go. That one's a little bit trickier since it there's a lot of dark in it. But um, these two are working out pretty well. So there you have it, tea toning uh, cyanotype type cloth prints.